How do the Crips people do it? What's up, y'all? Big Snoop D O Double G. Hello, and how you doing? Good to see you here. Let's get right to it. What's up? I'm Lexi. Welcome to my crib. Let's go. I'm done. That was really bad. Okay, here we have my desk. It's a really small desk. It's not really like the biggest work desk. My new goal is to not sit for that long every day. So I only sit down when I need to. This chair, it's vintage. It's been around since I was five. The leg's about to fall off, but it's fine because, like I said, I don't want to sit that much. This is a coffee cup with a butterfly on it. Um, I drank most of it today. This coffee cup is actually from Home Depot, so this is one of the few things that I can link in the description. These books are from Amazon, so I'm gonna link those too for you guys. Those are cute and aesthetic. This flower is from 10 years ago. Well, actually nine and a half. It's from 2012. Alex gave it to me when we went to prom together for the first time. Remember that, Alex? This desk, I forgot to mention, I got this at an antique store called Anna's in Highwood. So if you live in the North Shore area in Illinois, you can get it there. Actually, no, you can't. It's an antique. Never mind. I just want to say this wasn't my choice. My mom makes me keep these dolls in here because she says it's her house. So in her house, she makes the design choices. I just have to embrace it, I guess. They're collectibles. Uh, my family's been giving them to me since I was zero. So I had really no say. I don't know, my mom had somebody paint it with these pretty flowers. It used to be white, I think. This chandelier is from Venice, Italy. It's Venetian and it's pink and blue, but it's hard to tell with all the different color lighting happening in here right now. And all the lights are out because I never actually changed the light bulbs. This is my window seat. My mom basically had 100% of the say in designing this room. All of this is like custom designed by my mom. She is really into interior design. See, I said my room was a little bit cottage core and that's what I'm talking about. It's a little bit like, there's a little bit of country mixed in with this plaid pattern and the strawberries. This is my white Chanel bag from Rebag. These are my candles. Oh, I can link these actually. Something else I can link. They're from Anna's Candles. My Marshall speaker, I got this from Urban Outfitters. I always hook this up to the projector because I project movies on here at night and it's really cool. It's like my favorite thing to do to wind down. More dolls. I just ignore them. You can just ignore the dolls. We're just gonna ignore that. Another window seat. You can see the pool in the backyard through the window seat. People spent a lot of money in the 90s before the recession and my parents' favorite way to spend money was on antique furniture. So I'm not even allowed to sit on this chair it's just in here. I'm gonna tell you the truth, right? We never ate at this table. But it's pretty though, right? This is a little ottoman. My mom says the fabric is scalamandre. I don't know what that means. I had a blue Gatorade sitting on here the other day and she screamed at me. And she's like, not on the scalamandre. So I think that means it's really fancy. antique from Paris. This is my favorite piece of furniture ever. I'm obsessed with it. This pillow was custom made with some tassels. My mom loves tassels and everything is inspired by English vibes. The wood's imported from England from the 1800s. The stone is imported from England too. We totally missed the fireplace. I always wanted a room with a fireplace so when we moved into this house I was like I want the fireplace room. My parents never let me turn it on because I thought I would bring the house down so it's been used maybe once in the past 12 years. This lamp is my favorite ever. I love the roses on it. Some people might say it's like a little bit outdated or whatever. I love the grandma vibes and I think it's so pretty and elegant. I like these big bows right here. I'm a big bow type girl, big bow energy. And I like this, I used to play with this all the time. This blanket, it's been in a lot of my IG pics and so many of you guys are like, link the blanket, but I've had this blanket since I was five. So I didn't get it to go with the trend because this is trending really heavily right now. This is just something that's been in my life since forever. If you guys don't believe everything in my room is custom made, all the fabrics that my mom pulled to make everything. That drawer is just filled with a ton of fabrics, but look. These are the little fabric samples that she used to make up each piece. I recently got this mirror and this mirror 
at Anna's, the antique store. And this is the Marc Jacobs New Daisy Perfume Scent. And this is just a Chanel perfume. It's from Urban Outfitters. It's my morning journal. I make myself write three pages every morning just of like the random thoughts I have when I wake up. It's a new thing I'm doing. Let me know if you guys want a full morning routine. This dims too, look. The chandelier. I feel like bed skirts are out of style, but I like this bed skirt a lot. I think it's really cute. There used to be a carpet in here. Actually, there used to be a carpet in here, but my dog, Boomer, pooed on it so many times. Don't talk about this. <laughs> like, why? I got this mirror recently, found it antiquing. I don't know what to do with it. I don't know where to put it. So if you guys have suggestions on where I should hang it, let me know. Okay, the sink is disgusting, but it's gold, but I ruined it because I was in like seventh grade, so unusable. And here, I basically just have my face products, agency, a cleanser, toothpaste, and some retainer cleaners, and an extra toothbrush, miscellaneous, hair ties, pimple cream, Advil, Zyrtec, my retainer, more supplements, all of my retainer cleaners, tampons and supplements, face wipes, some biofreeze, because my back is always hurting, my Sonicare toothbrush, and this is like a little iPhone holder, so if I want to watch videos or film while I'm getting ready, I can go like this. And then this is my dermapore thing um, and basically it cleans out my pores and all the gunk on my face because I have really oily skin. This mirror, another antique. My makeup case, I keep everything in a makeup case because I just, I'll be messy if it's not all in one case. Q-tips, scrunchies a book just for fun this is my tub it even has the curtain with the tassel and it has this cute little detailing on the side and that's it for the bathroom also all the doors um the wood on the doors is actually antique it was imported from england okay that's it for the room tour i hope you guys enjoyed it i hope you're inspired by the aesthetic that i showed you and i'd love to hear your opinion on this design and my whole room aesthetic and be sure to subscribe so that you are here for next week's video all right that's it love you guys so much see you later like comment subscribe i tried to be like cribs but i don't think i'm meant for cribs love you see you next week bye